Let us discuss a very interesting question which has been asked very oftenly in recent placement examinations. The question reads, a sum of money becomes five times itself in seven years at compound interest. In how many years will it be 125 times itself? So if you read the first statement, there's a sum of money. Let's say sum of money was P. And it will become five times. Ho hai. So five times of P will become five P. So you need to realize, ye jo P is the principal and 5 P amount. Hai. And this has happened in a duration of seven years. Now the question is, कि ये 125 कितने सालों में हो जाएगा? Now see, there is one thing which you have to keep in your mind pertaining to CI, that is, principal का value will keep on changing for every compounding period. So for the first compounding period, the value of principal was P, but for the next compounding period, the value of principal needs to be updated. So the new value of principal will become 5P. Now if I ask you, कि next compounding period के end में, ये जो principal 5P है, ये कितना बन जाएगा? You would say 5 times. What is 5 times of 5p? You would say 25. Shall I stop at 25? No. Why? Because our goal state is 125. So, jab tak 125 nahi banega, tab tak hum nahi rukhenge. So, let's move forward. So, for the next compounding period, my new principal is going to be 25p. Again, calculate 5 times of it. And now, you would reach to the goal state, which was 125. Okay, so if you count how many compounding periods are needed, you would say 3 compounding periods. 1, 2 and 3. So, 3 compounding periods are needed of length 7 years each. So, what is the total duration? 21 years. It means 21 years mein mera principal 125 times ban jayega. Now, interestingly, if you want to solve the same question in less time, what you could have done is, this is a shortcut. Sabse pehle ye dekho ki, jo mera sum of money hai, wo kitna times ho raha hai. So, you write 5 times. Aur mujhe usse banana kitna hai. This is my goal state. I have to make it 125 times. So, just find ki 5 ki kaun si power 125 hoti hai to get the value of n. So, 5 ki kaun si power 125 hoti hai, you would say third power. So, yahaan se n ka value kitna aa gaya? 3 aa gaya. Now, if you ask me, ki n kya hai? n is the value of number of compounding periods. It means I need 3 compounding periods, where length of each compounding period is 7. So, when you multiply these two, you get the same answer 21. So, this is how easily you could have answered this question by applying this shortcut. If you have understood this trick, please like, share and subscribe.